Hey guys, this is Shiny Zachram, and welcome back to another part of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. In the last part, we went to Upper Forest, stopped the Mankey Gang, and with the help of Mankey Gang and Peel Chestnuts, as well as Why Not, Caterpie, and Wobbuffet, we got our rescue team base renovated. In this part, we're just gonna head through and try and get some missions done. So we're just gonna do that. First one I had was for Upper Force 9F. So we're gonna start heading through. Now I forgot to mention also in the last part, I did get Cyndaquil while doing the chestnut run in Upper Forest. Cyndaquil actually did hit 24. And Beldum's IQ went high enough to reach Self-Cure. So, I turned that on, and of course level 24. You know, it's just level 24. I didn't learn any moves or anything. And C-Dot's trying to join, which I don't care. I want to mainly just get some jobs done. And we get his sandstorm. Okay, after that, Fiesta, please hit, thank you. Finally get through that button, that. Yeah, head to 4F. Thankfully, we're finding the stairs pretty quickly. 5F. I'm just going to let my Pokemon fight this. And our Beldum hits level 19. Sorry, I thought I heard my phone going off, but I don't think I do. Oh, nice, 6F right here. And I'll sleep past the block it. Go away. 6F, alright. At least we're doing this pretty fairly quickly. Especially because it's only one job. C dot, I don't care. Sorry, usually I do accept a member on my team, but let's see. Yeah, okay, cherry berry, I don't care. On to seven. I think that was double critical hits. Nice ice beam. Nice. Thank you. Get rid of the C dot. Head to A dot. Nice, we can head straight to 9F and get to our mission real quick. Goodbye, Nuzleaf. Good, now we gotta find our client. There it is. 
A ditto. And we'll use our rescue badge to save Ditto, and our mission day is done. I didn't mean to do that. Thank goodness that we know where the stairs are. And because of it, Totodile actually hit level 25. Amazing. Something I didn't even mean to do. I'm just gonna go, I don't care about these guys. Go in here and possibly go further, time to go back. See, I just totally made that longer than it needed to be. <clears throat> and for Ditto, we get a black gummy and 60 rescue points. Nice. Did good today, let's knock off and call it a night. No saving. Good morning, boys. Okay. Oh, boys, we'll take that. And we're gonna go grab metal. No, we don't want to go here. Magnet quark. Get a special attack raised by one. We'll get Mal to join our party. And see what else we got on the board. Yeah, right there. Um, what would be our quickest? Uh, this probably would be a six effort. Same amount of mission points. Oh, did we just... I did. Oops. I'm not even going to go to Cacleons, to be honest. I just want to get this mission day over. Because if I'm right, I think we need to do three rescue jobs before we get the next storyline bit. And we get our client Manek to main neck trick. Like I'm not even skipping gravel I'm just skipping gravel rocks at this point because Thanks to Ice Beam, we take out the teddy from afar. Oop. Oop. No. I said go to ground. Right, anyways, Silent Chasm 2 up. I mean, that trick suddenly decided to go the wrong way, but thankfully we found the stairs. That could have been very disastrous. It's... Oh well, we ran into some gravel rock. We'll pick it up. Alright, a four. So get rid of everything. And 
And here we are, the 5F. And some gravel rocks. And we're the 6 f our mission floor already. And there's our far fetch client very quickly. Excuse me. And that was our rescue job day, just like that. It's nice that these are going very quickly. We get 300 polka dollars, brown gummy, and 40 rescue points. Yep, I thought so. Thought we had to do three jobs, unfortunately. Anyways. Not even a job. Come on. We'll give you the brown gummy, why not? Defense rose by one, nice. Anyways, again, we don't really have a need to go to Cacleons. So we're just gonna head right for the mission board and try and find some missions. I could probably do this. TM Taunt and TM Rest plus something. And it's two jobs. It's only 5 and 6 F2, so that's not too bad. We'll do that. And, like I said, so we don't waste as much time, we are not going to touch the Cacleon. We're not going to store anything. We're just going to head right to Frosty Forest. And again, it's only 5 and 6, so this should be fairly, fairly quickly. And we get Nidorino in our party. What's this? Stamina band, nice. Special bam, we can sell that later. Wow, we're doing this very quickly. We're already on 4F. I guess it really wants us to be quick with our mission days. I mean... Five up already. All right, we have to find. There's a Pucciana. Excuse me. Let's continue our adventure. Okay, so this floor is taking a little bit longer, but they're all good. Nose pass, we'll take that out. Goodbye, pile of swine. There's our stairs. On 6 up for a second mission. Did we use transform? Two of them. I did though.
Ooh, power van. Oh, bye, Dale. Oh, Struggle, you're a ditto. Bye bye. Come on. I want to find this mission. Just so we can get. Uh, oh, there we go. And we are going to head on out. That was really quick. Yet again, I should say. TM Taunt, 40 rescue points. TM Rest, that goes to Toolbox. It's fine. Reviver Seed, that's good to go to the Toolbox. And 100 rescue points. Yep, the next morning. Oh, wow, another earthquake. I guess it's all down. There have been a lot of earthquakes lately. Oh, already awake, Blaze? There was another earthquake earlier, right? There have been so many, I can't get a decent night's sleep. Hey! Hey, Lombre, what's up? We need you at the square. Everyone's gathering there. Is there something wrong? I'm not really sure. Shiptree's calling everyone out. It's getting the other rescue teams to come. Blaze, let's go! Here we go. So yeah, it's three jobs at least. Wow, look at all the Pokemon. Looks like they sent out a lot of rescue teams for help. I found some, I've seen some pretty famous leaders from faraway places. That's Shifter. I wonder what he's playing with all these rescue teams. Can I get everyone's attention here? I, uh, it's not my style to get up in front of everyone like this, but, and... Sorry, this isn't the time for that. There's big trouble. Alakazam's team went underground, but they haven't returned. What? Is that true? Yes, unfortunately. Alakazam led his team underground to quell Groudon, and that's it. We haven't heard anything from them. To be honest, we have no idea what became of them. No idea? How is that possible? This is Alakazam you're talking about? But they haven't come back. That's for real. And that's right. And as, it, and as it sounds, Groudon is out of our league. What is that? It's that tough, this Pokemon named Groudon? Why don't you go underground and see for yourself? Huh? You gotta be kidding me. There's magma filling everywhere underground. I'd burn up if I went anywhere like that. Quiet, please. Everyone, be quiet. There's no one to die in that is dangerous underground. It's not a place where everyone can go. That's why I asked so many re rescue teams to gather today. I propose that a special team be formed by choosing the best of the best. Who will step forward? Who among us will be the heroes to take on the challenges of the underground? Hey, boys, this is our some chance. Let's go for it. Don't bother, you guys. What's with you? Can you get out of the way? You guys have gotten a lot tougher, that's for sure, but there's plenty of tougher Pokemon out there. Will no one step forward? I'll go. Whoa. It's Blastoise. You mean Team Hydro's Roughneck Blastoise? Those wire spots on his back can rock give water so fast that it punches through thick iron plates. Turn ground on is a ground type. I'm a water type. Strong against the ground type. My hydro pump will put ground on down in one shot. I was in the party too. Woohoo, it's Octillery. She's Team Constrictor's leader. She's known for persistent and clingy attacks. She ensnares foes with tentacles, then headbutts them. She'd be nasty if facing any battle of endurance. Darling, so when I see a tough Pokemon, I want to tangle with them. See, how about not forgetting me? Wow, Golem. He's the most brutal of Team Rumble Rock. His body is rock hard. He's supposed to be able to withstand explosions without taking damage. Ground's awake and underground. That suits him fine. I'll use my rock there to keep it buried underground. Oh, Blaster is Octillery and Golem. No one could complain about your selection. We will have these three head underground for rescue. Yeah, good choice. You're representing us. Make us proud. Let's go. Win it for us. Save Alakazam's team. See? They look pretty tough, eh? Let them handle things. Okay. Guess we can't say anything, Blaze. I wish we could have gone too, but that's just too bad. 
Let Blaster's team take care of things underground. We'll keep giving our best in rescue work. All right, and that's where we're going to end off the part, guys. We did three days of rescue missions, getting four missions done, and finding out that Alakazam's team is still underground, and in trouble, possibly. So Golem, Blastoise, and Octillery sent off in order to save them. In the next part, I hate to say it, but we're just going to keep at going with missions. Excuse me. Hopefully we can get three done pretty quickly, so we can get some more storyline. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.